there are 10 railway stations along a line. A train has to be stopped at three of these stations such that they are not consecutive. It means no two of them are consecutive. Find the number of ways in which this can be done. So there are 10 railway stations along a line. So, so let's say this is line. So this is station 1, S1, S2, S3, S4, S5, S6, S7, S8, S9, S10. So we have to select 4 stations, I mean 3 stations such that no 2 are consecutive. So let us say I will select 3 stations. So if I select 3 stations, so let us say A, B, C is the way in which I am selecting the stations. So here what we are saying is, so this question if I solve with the help of generating function it will become easy. So what we will do is, so the number of stations to the left of A, the number of stations to the left of A or x1 between A and B or x2 between B and C or x3 after to the right of C I mean after C the number of stations left is x4. So x1 plus x2 plus x3 plus x4 is so already we are selecting 3 stations we have 10 so 10 minus 3 7 and we have a constraint here x2 x3 should be minimum of 1 because they should not be consecutive. So x1 x4 does not have any constraint so they can be zeros. So here the variables have different answers no so what we do is we'll convert everything to either 1 or 0. So what we do is we'll consider x2 is greater than or equal to 1 no so consider uh, x2 is equal to y2 plus 1 and x3 is equal to y3 plus 1 so that uh, y2 is also greater than or equal to 0 y3 is also greater than or equal to 0. So x1 plus x2 is y2 plus 1 this is y3 plus 1 plus x4 is equal to 7. So x1 plus y2 plus y3 plus x4 is equal to 7 minus 2 5. So here all of them xi is greater than or equal to 0. So this is nothing but number of non-negative integral solutions of the equation. So non-negative integral solutions of the equation x1 plus x2 so on to xr is equal to n. So here xi is greater than or equal to 0. So the number of solutions are n plus r minus 1 c r minus 1. So if I use the same thing here 5 plus 4 minus 1 c 4 minus 1. So it is 8 c 3. So 8 into 7 into 6 by 3 into 2 into 1. So 8 into 7 56. So the number of ways in which we can do this is 56 ways. So I will so I mean apart from the generating function I will solve another method. So what we have is 10 railway 10 stations out of which 3 we have to select. So we we cannot I mean the these are these are useful, these are non-useful stations kind of thing. So these are non-selective, I mean non-selected stations. So these are, these are the three which we have to select. So what we do is, so we need a gap of one between the selected stations. So what we do is, we'll first arrange the non-selected stations. How many we have? Seven. So those 7 will arrange first. So I will arrange the non-selected stations 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So out of I mean among them how many players are there? So these are non-selected I mean the stations which are vacant right. So out the number of places among them are see here there is one place, second place, third place, four, five. 6, 
seven, eight. So the number of places among the non-selected stations are eight. In these eight places, we have to select only three places. So if I select three places out of eight, so the number of selections will be eight C three. So this is eight into seven into six by three into two into one. So again, so for this question, I can do it easily like this. So what we do is first we'll arrange the non-selected stations. So the non-selected stations are seven. First arrange them. So among them there are eight places. Out of these eight places, we have to select three. So that our criteria is satisfied. So the number of ways in which we can do our NCR. So eight C three. 